What's going on, everybody? It is your boy, John from the Gamer Dude here, welcoming you back to another episode of Danganronpa 2 Goodbye Despair. In the last episode, we tackled floors 5 and 4 of the investigation period. Now we are going to tackle floors 3 through 1, probably. Um, I don't know how long these are going to be, so, I mean, it sounds like we're wrapping, kind of getting close to wrapping up. So, figure, give you guys a little bit of a breather, because y'all deserve it. Y'all had a crazy freaking episode, so... And for me, this is crazy because I'm like, this doesn't feel real, right? This feels crazy to me. Like, and some of these rooms are just gone, which is the craziest part. Oh, I should check my pet. The rec room is open. That's sketchy. There's the student handbook. There's a billiard table, a dartboard, and a shelf lined with magazines. It's hard to think this room actually exists inside of a school. It's a file with Hope Speak Academy seal on it. It says it's confidential. That means it's a big secret, right? Why would an important document be here? Why am I even asking a question like that? Obviously, Monokuma is responsible. Anyway, we need to confirm what's inside the file. About the Hope Peak Cultivation Plan. For many years, Hope Peak Academy has been conducted rigorous research on the, into various talents. The Hope Cultivation Plan seeks to use the fruits of our labor to further the tr true goal. With our hands, we will birth a true hope. And that will bring hope to the entire world. Truly, the program is... The next innovation, providing the ultimate education. This plan has been the Academy's wish since the foundation. So, we must succeed at all costs. What followed was a series of detailed instructions to in intricate and, in and intricate orders. It was full of difficult technical terms. I wish I had no idea that, or that, and I had no idea what any of that meant. However, the word true hope left a strong impression on my mind for some reason. The Hope Cultivation Plan was created for the sake of birthing true hope. Hope Speak Academy was behind something like that. I don't really get it, but there's something about these words. True hope, huh? Hope's Cultivation Plan has been added to the truth bullet section of your handbook. Different floating words. This hologram again. What does this one say? It looks like another email passage. Regarding the report we gave you the other day. We have finally succeeded in acquiring and place, or acquiring them and placed them in our care. Though they were all dispersed, we were successful in acquiring all 15. Due to the fact that we were unable to ask them about specific details, it is unknown how they managed to survive the tragedy. It has been reported that some are wounded, so it seems certain that they survived under harsh conditions. Over the course of our detailed investigation, we determined that they are the same age as the others. We have decided to entrust them to the survivors of the killing school life. As for the remnants of despair, there are still no solid leads regarding this matter, and we have no new information to report. We will continue with the investigation. Once they are discovered, we shall eliminate them immediately. Everything is for the sake of the future, filled with hope. Updated despair. Updated hope. It says they were succeeded in a, it says they succeeded in acquiring them and have placed them in our care. That means we should have been protected by the Future Foundation, right? Then why is this happening? If the Future Foundation was protecting us, then why were we forced to kill each other on this island? Well, I guess it's not that the Future Foundation set this all up. What's this? My my high man, if you keep boring like that, you're gonna get a toothache and collapse. It's your fault. That is the hologram. What is this hologram thing anyway? It's exactly what it looks like. They're emails to the Future Foundation. I thought they made it the perfect clue, so I did a little bit of hacking here and there and to get them. You, you can even do that. Whoever's controlling you seems to possess many talents. No, no. Oh, well, who cares about me anyway? That's not important at all. There's no way that's not important. His true identity should connect everything to what is happening right now.
Dartboard's just a normal dartboard. Monokuma models! There's only four! Anyway, I should let us leave, yeah. Oh! Shoot! I didn't expect to go down to the second floor that quick. Looks like we're in a different hallway again. I'm pretty used to that by now, but even so. What is this space? Am I dreaming or something? I mean, it's totally disconnected from reality. This is insane. That's what? It's like, oh, that makes sense to go to the library, John. That's like, that should have been super easy for me to detect. I should have sniffed that one out. This must be a library. Monokuma probably left something in here too. I just hurry and find it. I mean, this is one of them. This hologram again. It must be another one of the Future Foundation's emails. I should read it. There's no doubt it's another clue. To the Future Foundation's 14th Division, Makoto Nayagi! Okay. Makoto! What are you up to, buddy? Where are you guys? What are you doing right now? What are you doing? What you're doing is a serious act of treason. Do you, uh, treason, do you understand? Why are you protecting them? What the fudge? Why are you protecting the remnants of despair? It should be abundantly clear how, to you how dangerous it is to keep these people alive. Stay calm and think about this carefully. You guys are being lied to. Think carefully about what's important to bring the light of hope into this world. The six of you joined the Future Foundation because you agreed with our ideals, right? The Future Foundation rescued you from the tragedy you survived and cooperated with recovering your memories. Immediately return the remnants of despair to our headquarters. Unless we eliminate them, the tragedy will never end. Everything is for the sake of the future filled with hope. What does this mean? The email suggests that someone was trying to let the remnants of despair escape. The email was addressed to Makoto Naegi, but he was with the Future Foundation, right? Then why was he trying to protect the remnants of despair? Did he betray the Future Foundation? The email to the Makoto Naegi was added to the truth bullet section of the handbook. Is Nagito Makoto? But Nagito's dead, so it can't be that. Never mind. Reminiscence of Despair has been added to the Truth Bullet section of your handbook. Check the Truth Bullet section and review it. Now down to the first floor. No! Something else is going to open up. Oh, there's a newspaper of Juko just sitting here and a tablet. Huh? Didn't I just walk into a classroom? I don't really get it, but um, this looks like a laundry room. There's no use worrying about it. I was in a school and now I'm suddenly in the laundry room. Oh, I can't even do the Juko thing. I only have this one option. Tablet PC. This looks like a tablet computer. It looks like it's powered on too. Is this the next clue? I picked up the tablet and immediately started examining it. Neo World Program. The this word Neo World. I seem to recall hearing it and seeing it a few times already. The Neo World Program has another name. Psychotherapeutic Communication Simulator. The Neo World Program is built with the most recent psychotherapy technology and administrative software to develop the Neo World Program. Individuals such as the Ultimate Programmer 
The ultimate neuro the ultimate programmer. Whoa, 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 whoa. Chiaki is not the ultimate programmer. That's Chihiro. What is what did Chihiro do? The ultimate neurologist and then the ultimate therapist. Were among many talented people whose research results were utilized. Chiaki did whatever Chiaki did. What I'm worried about is Chihiro, obviously. What did Chihiro do? And then the ultimate therapist and ultimate neurologists. Are they in the next game? By mounting a device to the cranium, the Neo World program allows its subjects to experience a synthetic virtual world. Additionally, the Neo World program has another feature. It can replace memories formed in this, the real world with information contained in the synthetic virtual world. Therefore, it is possible to undo trauma sustained in the real world through the use of the virtual world. However, this device is for psychotherapeutic purposes only. Any other uses are expressly forbidden. Though it is highly effective in treating brainwashing, abusing the device risks total personality destruction. Thus, extreme care must be ex exercised with operating this program. Slowly, everything around me turned black. Synthetic virtual world program. A feeling of emptiness, like everything is being tainted. A feeling of weakness, like the world is collapsing beneath my feet. Everything started to feel meaningless. The desperate attempts and sad goodbyes. The conflicts, the trust I felt until now. It's all disappearing until all I feel is despair. Ah! I screamed out loudly as I was confirming the sound in my own voice. There's no way I can accept this. I am starting to accept that. This. This. There's no way. So something crazy as this actually exists. Nice. Ah, you gotta raise the flags more in order to clear my character out. <laughs> now then, despair is waiting for you. Impossible. This is impossible. It's all made up. Everything is all made up. Made up. And including me too. Neo World Program has been added to the truthful section of the handbook. Final floor. First floor. Oh, shit. Hey, how you... How are you doing? Did you enjoy the Killing Skull trip? By the way, do you guys remember the speech I made at the beginning? From this point on, I promise you the world... You a world that truly deserves to be called a game. <laughs> you gazer. The only ones watching this who can save them. The end of the world is nay. Watch. What or what you gonna do? That's gonna happen. What or what's gonna happen? Isn't it exciting? Isn't it heart throbbing? Look forward to it. <laughs> hallway when we first arrived here i walked down this hallway from the classroom to get to the gym it doesn't really resemble but holy shoop nougats this is crazy wait and then we're not going back to the gym oh my god i even have to i might have to put a seizure warning on this episode <laughs> jesus might be in my best interest This is, this is so well done, though. I saw this door, which is locked. That makes sense. So it's one of the classrooms. Oop. Oh, I can't check my, oh, it's probably my controller, I'm assuming. Yeah, it's, I was like, it's my controller. Oh, like, I need to check my pet, okay. Ooh. This gotta be. Okay, I was like, this gotta be my controller.
Classroom 1B. Big object. Big random object. Is this floating? That's impossible. There's no way something this big would be floating like this. But what in the world is it? And the moment I looked at that object... <clears throat> it's binary. Chiaki! Save us. Save us, Chiaki. Welcome. Welcome to the Neo World program. A, a person? A floating person is talking to me? Who was it? No. Is this even a person in the first place? Um, I'm quite... I'm not quite a person. I'm simply an artificial intelligence program. This would make me happy if you called me Alter Ego. Alter Ego! Yo, uh, welcome in, Alter Ego. That is my the name the master gave me when he created me. It can talk. But who are you? Alter Ego. Artificial intelligence program. I am the master program behind the Neo World program. I am responsible for creating and overseeing this world. However, only the observer has the authority to direct influence you guys. I can't actually exert much influence. In fact, my existence is one that you don't normally meet. I'm sort of like an apartment manager or something. I may observe the entire apartment building, but I lack the power to manage individual rooms. But the virus has infected everything I'm supposed to be managing. And because of that, this world I'm managing is acting very peculiar. Hold on. My brain can't follow what you're saying. Let me gather my thoughts first. Damn it. It's that feeling from earlier again. The floating, floating, like my feet are hovering above the floor. It's like I can't feel my feet on the ground. Like I can't even feel my own, or believe my own existence. Hey, you should know, right? Where is this place? Tell me, what is the Neo World program? The Neo World program is admitted as the data collection procedure for shaping the entire world. As such, the only data we collected during the experimental stage is being utilized. Specifically, that means the data detailing Jabberwock Island, where this research facility is located. That is why the previous Jabberwock Island cityscape was restored. Ergo, if I am to answer your question, where is this place? The answer would be mostly Jabberwock Island. Certain portions of it are different depending on the circumstances. Of, for example, the school you are in. It appears this place is entirely under a virus influence. That's probably why I'm appearing before you too. However, even without the virus, these circumstances are a bit unnatural. It seems the launch was rushed, and because of that, there weren't enough time to collect any data. I'm sorry, I do not know the circumstances of the outside world. After all, I am simply just an over overseer of the Neo, Neo World Program. Most of its words. I understood what they meant, but I couldn't understand what was being said. There was no way for me to acknowledge it as the truth. It would make much more sense if this was a fictional world. Wait, are you saying this is? This world is a fictional world? I feel... I feel like I cannot believe what's going on here. There's missing sense of reality. There are mysteries but all... Truths. Are they all truths? They're all just fiction? Is that... Even so, I needed to know. I need to know what this world is. Hey, can you tell me? Can you tell me what the Neo World program is used for in the first place? The Neo World program serves only one purpose. It is used to make the real world a splendid one. I guess you could say it's a program for creating hope. A program for creating hope. But the fact that we're here and the fact that we don't have our memories, that's all the program's fault, right? Deleting memory is the first step towards replacing memory. Replacing memory data is one feature of the Neo World program. With the installed memory control unit, it is possible to remove any time period you set it to. And from there, you upload the memories obtained in the virtual world. Removing memories at any time period you set it to? So Monokuma was right. We did lose our school memories. But why? Why us? Why were school memories taken away? There's a reason for that, right? That's a mystery to me too. Booting the program on the survivors of Hope Peak Academy while it's still in an experimental stage? I'm sure this was for a very good reason. But unfortunately, I do not know what's happening in the outside world. I'm sorry. Are you saying we're lab rats? That's the only thing I can think of. It sounds like we're just lab rats. The Future Foundation did this to us. But they're trying to save the world, right? 
What is the future foundation not our ally? I am sorry. I cannot provide that much help. If only I was more reliable. I wouldn't have lost my authority to the virus like this. All of these words make me f my head feel like it's about to burst. Can you tell me more about the Observer and that virus? Well, for this session, the Neo World program was programmed to house 15 people along with two monitors. Two monitors? Yeah, as they were discussed, that they were disguised as a teacher and one of the students. They were intended to guide the participants in this way. By the way, the Observer and the teacher role have been given the authority to influence all you all. But the observer in the student role was not. Oh! So... So Chiaki couldn't tell us anything, but Momonami could have. They weren't given any special authority at all. So they'd seem like it's the same as everyone else. What kind of authority does the teacher role have? An example, the teacher that creates the rules of this world and manages them. As the teacher is properly managing the rules they've created, there's no use. If the teacher is properly managing the rules they've created, there's no risk of abuse. And because the virus is infecting everything, that has changed. It changed this world where violence shouldn't have existed in the first place. The Neo World program would have promised eternal peace, but just like the outside world, it had become filled with violence and death. Well, what is that virus? I don't really know the details behind the true identity, but the function is beyond my capabilities. No matter how much I try to stop it, it behaves as if I already know what I'm attempting to do. In the end, it stole the portion of my abilities which contained my authority to build the world. It is like it was a grandmaster chess player. I desperately tried to fight back so it wouldn't have complete control, but even so... A portion of the world has been modified at its convenience. She's probably talking about Monokuma Rock and the Funhouse. Based on what she's saying, it sounds like she is on the receiving end of a one-sided attack. But Alter Ego should be an impressive artificial intelligence the Future Foundation created. I can tell that just by communicating with her. Which means this supposed virus is so smart that it surpassed this Alter Ego. If so, does that virus possess an artificial intelligence just like her? Damn it, what the heck? An artificial intelligence waging an attack against another one? It's That's so freaking irritating. But how did that virus infect the Neo World program? The Neo World program exists in isolation. It is impossible it was infected through a network. It's possible it was infected through a network. I'm fairly certain someone physically uploaded it. Physically? Perhaps someone secretly brought an external memory drive containing the virus into the facility and directly uploaded it to the main computer where the Neo World program is installed. Based on my calculations, that is most likely what happened. It was brought to the Future Foundation facility, but the only person who could have had entered the facility is someone who's a member of the Future Foundation. Damn it, what am I thinking? Why am I assuming that what I heard is the truth? Why am I assuming that everything is a lie? Observers has been out of the truth bullet section of the handbook. The Neo World program has been updated in the Truth Bullet section of the handbook. Ah, uh, but it's true the virus is powerful and that it com I'm completely overwhelmed by it. But I'm still able to defend the essential areas, so it has a limit too. A limit. If it if it took over an observer, then it has to follow the rules of an observer. Um, as such, in order to end the program and release everyone, I need to follow the corrupt procedure and. Okay, even if you're just a god in the machine, it's enough hints from you. If you're gonna say something more, suppose that you exist between life and death, and death of yourself is inevitable. If so, it can be parallel to the defluxuation based on the definition of existence that constitutes the relationship, and from there, the partigum change results by the cut off rapidly and causes situations where your own existence is unobservable and accelerates and crosses with the joint leadership or joint ownership of this world and situation from the context that invites your hey death 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 death
That looks like Makoto now. What the heck? What just happened? You're right. You're right there, aren't you? Someone is right there, right? Huh? Who are you? Are you different from the earlier one? Maybe he can't hear my voice in, from this side? I'm currently talking to the world through Alter Ego. Ever since you guys vanished into that space, the video's feedback has been pretty distorted. But even so, we were forced to watch you this entire time. Huh? There are things you guys were forced to do. We were forced to watch it. Forced to watch us? I really want to save you right away, but there is a virus in... Because of the virus's interference, I couldn't. Our orders are to no longer being accepted, including the shutdown requests. Neo World Program is beyond our control now. In that world, that person created an independent country and doesn't accept the outside interference. But Alter Ego created an alter, uh, opportunity for me to speak to you directly. If this means it, that's working, then it means that the person I need to talk to is right here, I hope. It looks like the guy... It looks like this guy can't even hear me or see me. Just, who is this guy anyway? It's Makoto. Is he our ally? Since there's no time, I am going to say what I need to say and believe you're there listening to me. But first, I should apologize to everyone. I know apologizing won't help. We didn't imagine something like this would happen. We never expected such an atrocious virus was lurking inside the Neo World program. But that's entirely our fault and it's our responsibility for not realizing it until it was too late. But it's not just the virus either. I can't say for sure, but this program didn't have any problems in the first place. To tell you the truth, I was unsure about whether you guys, or whether or not to run the program on you guys. But this was the only way to save you all. I wanted to save you guys. Save us. What did he want to save us from? Why did this save us? You've already seen the password to enter the graduation exam ground, right? You know, 11037. 11037. That's the number found in Nizimi Castle. That door to the ancient ruin was supposed to open after you guys finished gathering the hope fragments. From there, you guys were supposed to challenge the graduation exam. However, I prepared that password in case something went wrong. Like I said earlier, I had my doubts that this program was perfect. Even if the chance was slim, I thought the observer might end up going rogue. That's the reason I left that 1103 password in the place where the teacher role would not be able to go. I thought... I never thought Nagito saw it first would erase that password. Anyway, I... Also the person who set that password... to Set the password to that number. That number contains a secret. Someone close to me left that number to save me when I was in a dilemma. Can you understand what I'm trying to say? I'm entrusting that will to you all. I've entrusted it to your future. But that person is trying to abuse the graduation exam. I'm sure they are going to crush you with despair using the graduation exam that is waiting for you. But I want you guys to endure it without giving up on hope. I want you guys to withstand it until I get there. Because I have a secret to defeating them. Does that mean he has a secret plan to defeat Monokuma? In worst case scenario where an observer, where an observer who has the role of a teacher goes rogue, I have prepared a hidden command to use at the graduation exam site. It's the force shutdown sequence. Force shutdown sequence. Even a teacher's authority cannot stop that command. It is a, a way to end this that you guys can choose on your own, independently of the observer. Which means, if they stole a teacher's role as authority, they shouldn't be able to stop it. If you guys use that, you guys will win. However, in order to start the force shutdown sequence, you need more than half the number of people. And in order to do that, I need to somehow get that number. Uh... Bye, Makoto. Hmm? What was that just now? Hmm? Hey, Hajime. What was that weirdness just now? Nothing really. Hmm. I see. Oh, well. Anyway, that's all the hints you're going to get. If that's no good, artificial intelligence tells you any more useless stuff. I'm going to butt it again. Did Monica notice what just happened? It's been a while since I've spoken to length, but it was important to talk to you. It was worth waiting a long time here. Hey, about that guy just now. 
There shouldn't be anything else for you to ask me. I see. It'd be bad if Monokuma overheard us. That means Monokuma doesn't know about the conversation I had with the guy just now. Uh, you guys have a weapon. A very powerful weapon. It all depends on how you guys use that weapon. The only That's the only thing I can do. Is prevent the virus's invasion with all my might so you guys can use that weapon. The rest of it is up to you. Do your best. Do your best, huh? But what do we have to do our best at? The mystery getting solved? I'm finally about to see the truth. But what are we supposed to really do when that truth is really a lie? We know we're working hard towards a conclusion, but nobody wants to hear. But still, do we really need to work hard and do our best? Is there really a reason to do our best? If everything was a lie, then isn't everything just meaningless? It's the same for the killings too. Even though we had an experience, we had to experience something painful as that, something tragic as that, wouldn't it all be meaningless too? When the world flipped over, when the world is flipped over and became so irrational, what am I supposed to do? 11037 has been added to the truth bullet section of your handbook. Shut down sequence has been added to the truth bullet section of your handbook. I knew it. Oh crap. Okay. Um, so, uh, I'm getting tired of waiting. Shall we just plunge right in? It's time for the long awaited graduation exam. Please enter the red door located on the first floor of Hope Speak Academy. <laughs> See you soon. The red door, huh? It's just a waste of time thinking about what this all means right now. For now, I need to finish this. I need to focus on that. Now, I believe that it's going to let us save like it has been, so... He means this red door, right? Do I just have to go in here? If I do that, will this be finished? No, of course not. Oh, jeez Louise. Class trial ground one. Uh, this place. Yo. Looks like everyone's here. Right. It seems that. It seems that this is going to be the final place. However, this place is. Is this a trial field? But why is it a trial field? Sure looks like a trial ground, but the vibe is way different from the one before. Um, We've been here before, right? Yeah, this should be the place that that door at the ancient ruins led us to. Hey. Huh? It's pretty strange that we've been in this building, or been in this building up till now. It. It's like we're dreaming or something. If this is a dream, then this is very... Welcome! Ah, so you finally arrived! Congratulations! You guys are the first ones to ever beat this game! Stop ever after stopping my Hope Speak Academy. I, you, you finally come back to this place. To the graduation exam site within the ancient ruins of the Jabberwock Island. You can give it a fancy name like graduation exam site, but there's no different from a trial ground from before. Ah, uh, this trial field has expired. Inspired the one from before, so in a way, this place is the original. Who cares? The graduation exam means we can finally go home, right? Ah, uh, but if that's what you guys decide, that is. And we have to decide what we have to do. Now then. Please take a look at the LCD touch panel built into your seats. Compa uh, compared to the other trials, the results are much simpler this time. Yes, the two options are graduate and repeat, right? If you guys choose one of them, you just have to choose one of them and press it. All of you will cast your vote, and whichever one has the majority will be considered your final decision. If you don't press either of them, It'll be treated as an absence and will not be counted. Words, which means everyone will, uh, who has died up to this point will have their votes treated as absences. What? Then, 
then the results are based on majority vote. Uh huh. If graduates, if graduate is chosen by majority vote, from there, like an event that's kind of like a graduation ceremony called the graduation program will begin. Even if we do this stupid majority vote, the result is already pretty damn obvious. Come on, let's move along. We can press it now, right? No, no, no. You can't do that yet. I mean, your resolve hasn't firmed yet, right? Or your will to be swept away by society's harsh current? Shut up. Shut up. Who the hell cares? I'm going to press it. What's this? My, my. Which of your orifices are you going to be using to spew that? Or to you? Are you using to spew bile? To participate in the graduation program, you need to... F my final say is your teacher, you know. What does that... What does that mean it won't end with a majority vote? That's right. After the vote, I'm going to judge every single one of you to see if it's okay for you to graduate or not. So even if we vote, you're saying we won't graduate unless you acknowledge it. No. Oh, I'm terribly sorry for being rude earlier. Oh, you don't have to worry. There's no way I won't acknowledge your graduations. It is merely a formality. I am just doing it because that's how it has to be. He's doing it because that's how it has to be. It doesn't mean he can exert his will over everything. He's had two has a limit. Is this what Alter Ego is talking about? Anyway. Even if you don't want to do it, you guys still need to solve the mystery. Afterwards, you can cast your majority votes and from there move on to the graduation program. <laughs> but why do we have to go through something so dumb? Hmm. Ah, well that is... You said you were waiting for the main cast, right? Mm -hmm. Which means you were stalling for time then. <laughs> Who's the main cast? Hmm. Oh, no worry, need to worry about that. It has nothing to do with you guys. There's no way it has nothing to do with us. We are the only ones who are involved, you know. It doesn't matter if you're involved or not. You are just a bunch of chumps in a big picture. That's why it has nothing to do with you. Just perform your roles without complaining. Hit Hold on. Off. What's with that chump comment? Ah, <clears throat> uh, that, not that it's important or anything, but make sure you turn off that toy. How dare you, you treat him like a toy? What's this? I did, did I, I did treat it like a toy. You got a problem with that? I created everything. <laughs> You're actually picking a fight with me. I'm basically a god. Just how promising can you guys be? I guess this is just natural of life. Fine then, before you die, sear my power into your memories. Would you like to save progress? Yes, we would. And in the next episode of Danganronpa 2, Goodbye, despair. We are going to do case six is prep or course like court prep thing. And basically it's a trial, um, trial six. So, um, yeah, so we're doing the final trial. And so my next recording session is going to be the final recording session. That's insane. Thank you guys so much for watching. Love you all. Bye.